મોસ્યા મોગજ્યા યાજ્ઞિક ભાવાનો અને ભાવા બોયનીનો મોસી દોન દિન વાસનેચી શેવટાચી ઉતરા સંચ્યા દી દોન ગોરજેચ્યો કોળોને કરું સોતા પોયલી કોલોણી મુલ્યાર તુમકા ગોડેક આમચે પ્રોસીદ પોત્ર સકુલ લેટ યા મુયનેચે સાત તરકે છે તુમકા પાવલ આસ્તેલે We observe tomorrow in all the dioceses of India, tomorrow, Friday, a national day of prayer and fasting for the church and the nation. I would just like to read two small parts of this circular. I suppose all of you have read. The President of the Catholic Bishops' Conference of India has recently issued a circular informing that the members of this Episcopal body during their last plenary assembly held in the month of January 2024 had resolved that a national day of prayer and fasting for the church and for the nation should be observed throughout our country on Friday, the 22nd of March, 2024. Prayer and fasting for the church and for the nation during Lent are most desirable Lenten practices bringing a lot of spiritual benefit for individuals, communities, and the society as a whole. By engaging in prayer and fasting, we align ourselves with God's purposes, seeking His intervention in the spiritual battles that affect both the church and the nation. Through these practices, we wage war against sin, injustice, and spiritual oppression, inviting God's kingdom to come and His will to be done in the church and in the nation. I call upon all our clergy, especially pastoral clergy, to inform their respective parishioners about this special day of prayer and fasting for the church and for the nation, and to organize at least a few of the spiritual exercises suggested in this circular on Friday, the 22nd of this month. May the Lord listen to the united prayer of His children and send them His help and protection. Aantum ka sogliang ulomata, sogliang cha yadnikang, dharmikang, લોકે કાંગ નોઈસ ફાલેચા દીસા પુણ્યાં દીસાની અને આ મહિન્યાની ખેરીત ભાષેન પવિત્ર સોભે ખાતીર અને આમચા દેસા ખાતીર થામો નાસ્તના દેવાક વિનંતી કરું